Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. It's Murder One here, back again with another Quake 4 gameplay reaction. Today we got a duel on Quake 4 Max, me versus Staiwu, and we're on the map Frantic. This is a recent game that we just did. I played this uh, game last week, I believe, with um, Staiwu. Played a nice little five set of games, so I'll be uploading some more of the games um, in the coming weeks, of course. Um, but yeah, man, this is the first game in a while that we've played, so um, we were a little rusty. As you see, we made a straight mistake off the bat there, not getting the bottom yellow, and we fall. Score is now um, negative one to zero, end up killing ourselves there with the rocket. So we spawn in, grab the Hyper Blaster and the LG, and we hope to make a move on the Red Armor, which should be coming up next. In a bit of a stalemate here now, we are at the disadvantage, so technically shouldn't be fighting this. But, you know, we're trying to get a feel for the game. I believe this was like the third game in the uh, set we did. We played two on Monsoon and then uh, we played two here. So I'm still trying to get the feel back again since it's it, it was literally about a, a year since I played last. So, trying to get back in the dual mix, you know what I'm saying? So, hopefully we can get some more games in. Gonna drop in the lava there now to get um, a tick of damage so that I could deny the 50 health bubble and just waiting on the red now we're gonna get that move up to 123 armor doing some nice damage here hitting and not getting hit this is the uh, the crux of frantic I'm gonna be able to tickle the opponent from long range as you can see there hitting him with the machine gun not getting hit back touching him with the LG splash damage off the wall there dodging nades this is uh, kind of how you want to play frantic, um, you know, just whittling the opponent down until the time comes for you to get into a real fight, so that you, you know, you keep your advantage. So, because there is no mega health on this map, this strategy works very well. This map essentially has a red armor and three um, yellow armors. He has the top yellow, the bottom yellow, and then 50, um, 50 shards spread out over the map. One by the grenade launcher, one by the LG, and one back by the um, shotgun spawn on top of the jump pad. So whittling the, uh, you know, health away slowly is um, a very effective strat as the opponent is not easily able to um, replenish health. This is a, uh, you know, he armor heavy map, so. So that's that, but um, score is negative one to one now. We look to make a move to get back in the game. Got a hundred armor, a hundred health. Gonna fall into the red armor room there, taking some damage, pick that up and uh, Looking to try to work our way out of here now. Gonna spam, spam some Hypo Blaster. Had to uh, wait there to make sure that he wasn't gonna, you know, spam down with some rockets later. Nice battle here by the shotgun. Now we're gonna take out the rockets, switching from the LG. I'm gonna get two nice rockets in, catch him off the spawn here. Get two great rockets and uh, clean that up with the LG able to take the red armor as well we're gonna try to move right back in the, to the middle now so that uh, we don't get trapped Ate a direct rocket there but we, you know we were stacked up on armor so we're pretty good to go still as long as we're doing some decent dodging we should be fine now we're gonna look to uh, see if we can get our health back up here I'm down in the red armor room there so gonna look to still try to avoid fights and just try to uh, you know build the health back up ran into him there now and um, pretty low so he knows that he advances on us and we got two good rockets though so he's pretty low catch him off the spawn again but uh, great LG you know style was I said has great uh, LG aim and uh, tracking aim in Quake 4 so was able to take us down but off the spawn we are able to get him to crater by hitting a great rocket right outside of the grenade launcher um, drop down there gonna do a wall ride now man that's a nice move there by me wall ride to um, 
sneak up on him. The rockets that he shot helped to boost us a little bit, so um, we were able to get up close to him before he, you know, really recognized what was happening. So, nice move there. The wall ride um, is a move you can do that gets you, if you do it properly, it can get you up to 450, 470 UPS. With the rockets he shot, though, it boosted me up to like 560, I think it was, or whatever it said, I'm not sure. But uh, yeah, it was good move, man, to, to sneak up on, in that hallway there on Frantic. Um, you know, they'll hear your footsteps walking, but they won't expect you to descend on them that fast. Dumb mistake there, now I made, um, you know, I'll call that rusty, I switch into the uh, LG. We'll chalk that up to rust. Should have just kept the rocket out. Would have been an easy shot in the air there to uh, close things out. Red armor is going to take a while to come back up so we can't stay. And we're forced to abandon that spot there. Establish ourselves on the top though to um, see if we can get some pot shots in. It's going to drop down. We're going to fake going through the teleporter. Get a direct rocket. Go through the teleporter. Go up top to get the yellow. And then we're going to drop down and try to establish position now. We should be fairly even on health and armor at this point. And so, you know, we can combat different areas as we um, proceed. I'm gonna do a little ledge jump now to try to avoid these grenades. And again, we're gonna try to work our way out of the red armor room there. Try to sneak up on him. Did land our jump in time though. And so he pushed us back into the lava. Great move by Staiwu there. Score is now 6 to 4 in his favor. And again, we uh, were able to grab the LG off the spawn. Notice that he didn't come up top there, so we can work our way around. Gonna grab these shards. We're up to 100 armor again. Grab our rocket now so we can, you know, play some good defense. Denying the LG, gonna pick up the shards and see if we can establish ourselves up top. And now we can wait to see uh, what his next move is. We're gonna hear him down the bottom there. We're gonna shoot a nice rocket. Get into the LG battle here. We're gonna keep our aim solid and we're able to win that with just eight health remaining. He's gonna rush after us at the spawn. Luckily, the health bubbles are up, so we were able to get those. He still burns off uh, the majority of what we picked up though. We're gonna get a nice rocket top to uh, bottom to top there and then we go through the teleporter, clean it up with, uh, with the LG. Here the spawn though, we can't fall down unfortunately. He spawned close, fortunate for him there. So now we're pretty much out of luck. No health is up, so um, you know, we fall there. He's gonna rush us right off the spawn now. Gonna aim to do some damage, much damage as we can with the shotgun, and then we end up falling once again. Spawn on the other side of the map now. We uh, do get the LG, so we're able to drop down and then, you know, take position on the red. Spam some HB, switch back to the LG now, and then gonna get into another LG fight here. Aim failed at the end there, man. Um, you know, our tracking needs work doesn't help that we keep taking months and months off but uh, that would have been a, a more even fight there if uh, you know our tra tracking was solid but uh, he ends up getting the kill there nice rocket from us though um, and uh, we end up getting that frag back no health though so we uh, retreat back to the weaker side of the map which is the shotgun spawn side I'm gonna pick up the bottom yellow and 225 health bubbles Go through the teleporter to establish top position and I'm going to deny the lightning gun. Going to aim to deny this top rocket now. Got the LG out, only one rocket though. We shoot it to make sure he knows that we have the rocket and not to come around the corner. Did get the job done, we got him to retreat and then now we're going to aim to stack up to 200 with the red armor. Gonna do a little uh, ram jump there. Ate a grenade, unfortunately. Nice nades by Staiwu. One minute uh, warning was given. Mistake there from the Rust Man. We miss our rocket jump, and so now we're basically screwed. Um, yeah, we're gonna try to work our sneak our way out, but uh, of course he's on top of it. Staiwu, as I said, high level player. Probably the best um, player NA right now, I believe. Don't think anybody can beat him uh, 
consistently in uh, North America from what I've seen. I think he's pretty much uh, beating everybody now. But uh, we do get one back here. Try to find him off the spawn. We get a fortunate spawn here. So we're going to aim to advance on him. We'll jump on the Hyper Blaster Legend there then circle back around so you can uh, trick him with the sound. Trying to look for the last kill here though. But he spawns on the other side of the map. And we unfortunately fall in this one. Final score 10 to Staiwu, 9 to me. Great duel, man. I was pretty good, uh, pretty happy with uh, how I played in this one. Considering I was, uh, you know, off of uh, Quake for like uh, 11 months or however long since I uploaded. So that's going to be the video for today, man. Hit the like and subscribe button. Share with your friends. Turn on your notification bell. It's your boy, Murder One. I'll be back in the next one. Peace.